close grip bench press. So just like our regular bench press, now we're literally just coming in close together, okay? Now this range of motion might change depending on what your mobility flexibility is through your shoulders uh, and through your elbows as well. So uh, for this one, I should be able to get all the way to my chest, uh, but I'll show you how to work around that if you can't necessarily get to your chest. So for close here, again, our regular position where you're most comfortable, bring that in nice and tight, okay? So our elbows should end up being real close together, hence close grip. Here we go, let's give it a try. Same thing still apply. Shoulder blades back, coming down. Bring that rib cage down, flex those abs. So now I'm right here, for me, it's gonna be right where that knurling starts. Still gonna keep my shoulder blades back. Lift up, bring it to in position. I still want to lock those elbows in nice and tight, so I'm locking my lats and I'm gauging my triceps. Coming down, nice under control. Exhale up, and then open up those triceps. Again, lock it in, like you're trying to bend the bar. Exhale up, open up those triceps, okay? I'm gonna wrap that. So that one, I have the mobility to get all the way to my chest. I'm gonna show you if you don't necessarily have the mobility, uh, if it bothers your wrist or your elbow or in your forearm too much, if you're trying to bring it to your chest. So it looks something like this. All the same things apply. Shoulder blades back, belly tight, lift that bar into position, lock those lats, elbows in tight. If you're coming down, maybe start to feel too much pressure right here, that's fine. Push back up, just do that. Work through that. Here, open up those triceps still. And then wrap it. So work to whatever range of motion that you have, uh, then try to break up that scar tissue through those elbows. Just take it under control, keep that belly nice and tight, nice, slow, and controlled.